Hello, my name is Cameron Hines. I'm a Warren Peer Academic Advisor. In this video, we will discuss how to choose your programs of concentration if your major is within the social sciences. Warren College requires you to complete courses in the two disciplines outside of your major, the Humanities and Fine Arts and the Natural Science, Math, and Engineering disciplines, in order to give you breadth of study. Your major falls under the social science discipline, so you're required to complete one program of concentration in humanities and fine arts, and one program of concentration in natural sciences, math, and engineering. To complete each program of concentration, you must take six four-unit classes, three of which must be upper division, classes numbered 100 through 199. Look at the columns for the humanities and fine arts and the natural sciences, math, and engineering disciplines. Choose your two programs of concentration by choosing one of the program of concentrations listed in each column. Say for example your major is psychology, which falls in the social sciences discipline, and you decide to take six four-unit biology classes, at least three of which are upper division, to complete your natural science, math, and engineering program of concentration. Similarly, you choose to take six four-unit visual arts classes to complete your humanities and fine arts program of concentration. Notice that your major and your two programs of concentration must be from different disciplines, meaning that your major and your program of concentration are non-contiguous or unrelated to each other. Warren College also offers specialized programs of concentration in all three disciplines that allow students to take classes from different departments or have special requirements. If you are interested, please meet with an academic counselor to discuss how to complete these specialized programs of concentration. You can also apply AP and IB credit to complete your lower division classes for your program of concentration. Please see an academic counselor if you have questions regarding this. We hope that this video is helpful.